Okay, YouTubers, this beard is getting a little bit overgrown. So I think it's time to make an adjustment here. The great thing about wearing a beard is you don't have to shave every day. The bad thing is the snot catcher here. I think what I'm going to do with a snot catcher is leave it alone and try and get it to go away from the nostrils. Maybe put some rubber bands here on the end. But mow the rest of it down a little bit. I was thinking of taking a mustache off, but that would look stupid, kind of like an Abe Lincoln or, or an Amish man or a Mennonite. I forget whatever guys wear their beards that way. So we got the, the 7 8 clippers. I ought to mow it down a bit to manageable level. Yeah, that's thinning it out. I'm thinking of getting the mustache, maybe get, figuring out, get some of that mustache wax and get that snidey whiplash thing going. Oh, that is taking off a lot more than I figured. That ain't too bad. I can do all that. Do this every two, three weeks. That's going to be the tricky part. I gotta do it left handed, crying out loud. That's about the effect I'm going to try and go for. If I was a real cheap bastard, I'd do the whole, the whole scalp of this dimension since I've had in the past. 
see that twenty dollars in tip at the barber shop. It's not easy maintaining my status as a fashion icon. And any YouTubers got any any pointers and recommendations on mustache wax? Let me know. I suppose I could use my go-to coconut oil then. And it would complement my cooking. Maybe the snot would slide out of it real easy. And my dogs love the beard. I think they make it think I'm one of them with that on my face. Yeah, these beard hairs go every which way, so you don't know if you're giving them all a call all the way or not. Who's that old ugly bastard looking at me? God bless the tubers.